Peace by my sister, how y'all do? I want to do a Sephora VIB sale haul, although it's not really all that big. <laughs> um, okay, let's just get straight into it. So I have a hand mask. This is the Mango Hand Mask, Nourishing and Repairing. I don't know if I had this one before, but with the season change, my hand needs it. That's for sure. Then I got the clean last stash to go. So these are all like the natural type of mascaras. Cali Ray, Ilia, Milk. I can't read those other two. I'm gonna need to change my mascara again soon, so my stash is minimizing like i said i need to stock up on my deodorant so i was gonna buy it anyway might as well get a little bit of change off of it and then i got two of the cotton pads because i think sephora collection is 30 percent off so i needed one but i just got two and I find these are not that expensive, but they're definitely better quality than the drugstore one I had. And I use my points to try this out. I don't even know if this is going to actually fit my fingernails. But this is a little um, nail sheets. I think that's what they call them. Yeah, nail wrap sheets. <laughs> and it's in silver never tried them so thought it would be fun because press-ons never stay on and then usually i get this one everything's about to fall i usually get the saint jane luxury body serum it's almost done this time i decided to try the prima beyond body oil and this one has magnesium plus something and it's 600 milligrams of the CBD so it's another type of CBD oil I'm curious as to what this smells like though because the other one kind of has like a lemony or just fresh kind of calming scent Let's hope this one doesn't stink. Because, I mean, you never know, really. So, this is what it looks like. The other one is in a completely dark bottle, so I don't know if I should be concerned. Okay, this one smells a little bit more herbal, but it definitely has a calming kind of scent to it I'm not gonna actually use it until it's time to and if I'm sweating it's hot in here um, I don't know if y'all want to see what the mascaras look like well what the bottles look like I'm not gonna open any because I don't open them until I'm using them And then there's something in it to redeem for a full size of, I guess, whichever one you like. I also have something to redeem. Don't I have something for a free perfume to redeem? I think it was around the time that um there was a other sale, so everybody else was also redeeming it. So it kept going out of stock. I have no idea where I put that voucher. And then, I think, did I buy this or was this a points thing? I'm just checking my minutes. Um, yeah, I bought this. This is a mini. So this is the mini Indigo Overnight Repair by Tatcha. And it's just a mini serum. I always like to get the minis first because Tatcha is not cheap. So, 
looks like well, looks like all the other jaws. It smells like regular like non-scented lotion, and it's a thicker type of serum. So I wanted to make sure I got something that I could use as it gets colder. Or even though it hasn't been colder, my skin has still been changing. Like we're going into winter anyway. So I guess my skin knows something I don't. Then um, I just got a new sharpener. Because I always can't find one. So there's that. I got two um, travel size perfumes. So this one is the replica when the rain stops. It's supposed to be a fresh type of scent. I wanted to um, see what it was smelling like. I had the full size in my cart, but I'm like, what if it stinks on me? Because it's always a gamble for me and Replica. Like, it will smell great when you spray it, but on me is a different story. So I'm like, let me just get the travel size, even if it's 15% off still. This smells like a Bath and Body Works thing. Or should I just spray it in the cap? The cap's kind of small though. It got on my finger. Did you hear my stomach? <laughs> I think it's a unisex scent, but I feel like this will smell bomb as hell on a man. Or if you just like um, manly, manly scents in general. But yeah, I'm glad I didn't buy the full size. This reminds me of something though. I don't know what, but it reminds me of something. Usually replica scents are pretty unique, but this particular scent reminds me of another perfume I've smelled before and I don't know what it is because I'm sure I probably don't own it anymore um I was looking for the notes but it's not on the mini bottle my mother would love this she loves the stronger type scents so to me it's it's like a herbal fresh rather than like an aquatic airy type of fresh so if like you want a fall winter fresh scent oh i know what it reminds me of it reminds me of one of the bath and body works um men's like deodorant type sprays bot full body sprays I don't remember which one, but it reminds me of one of those. Yeah, this is going to my mother. And then I got a sample of the Burberry Hero. Because I just love smelling different perfumes, even though I really don't like most of them. <laughs> I'm very particular about scents. That is beautiful. I love that. This is like a fresh floral? I could be mistaken. I don't know, it smells like it has a fresh like citrus floral thing going on. I could do with this one. This one's more lighter. Now I don't know if this is a woman's or a men's traditionally. I don't care. But I do like it. And the other perfume sample I got was Good Girl Gone Bad by Killian. I might have smelled this. I'm not sure. Anyway, this one is a like this is a citrus and rose type of thing so orange blossom osmanthus and tuberose don't ask me what that second thing is because i don't know 
I only have one Killian perfume full size that I fell in love with that smells like marshmallows. <laughs> It doesn't stink, but it won't go with my body chemistry. I know that for sure. It's one of those things where, like, if you smelled it on somebody, you're like, yeah, be like, yeah, she smells sexy. But it would have to go with your body chemistry. That goes to my mother as well. She's banking out right now. Lastly is Alien Goddess Mugler. And the travel size and it's gold on white so seeing this is a joke <laughs> and this one what did I do I tried to take off the cap and the whole thing came off this one I think I've smelled plenty of time sample wise but I don't think I've ever put it on like, I think I've seen it in a magazine or something. I, don't, I can't recall. Oh, yeah. This one's, like, soft and gentle and sweet. Angelic. And this is what it looks like. Mommy, wait. Alright, gotta go. Bye.